Morning YouTube, friends and family. Oh, uh, we had to get up early on a Saturday. We're taking Milo to the bus station so that he can go to Boston to, to do what, Milo? Uh, to visit my uncle and soon to be aunt. <laughs> Milo's first trip on public transportation alone. I was nervous for about 30 seconds until I realized he just finished hiking 500 miles pretty much on his own. So if anything goes wrong, you can just walk to Boston. That's right. You know you can make it. <laughs> The Viles Arboretum. This is where I used to work before I owned my own business and became a carpenter. They are having a volunteer breakfast. Andrea wrote a book on natural history for this Viles Arboretum and donated it to them. So um, we get invited to stuff, to things like, you know, volunteer breakfast as a result. the bus We're all by see lonesome. if we can find somewhere to send our other two kids away for the weekends <laughs> school we have a little trail network called the happy trail that the happy farm trail I guess the happy trail means something else anyway uh, it made me think about public lands and private lands and how in Maine we have very little public land whether that's National Forest or Bureau of Land Management land or uh, any kind of other preserve or reserve however I did learn this year that Maine has the most robust uh, conservation easement, um, you know, land trust lands of, of any state in the nation. So while we don't have much public land, we have the most private land that's put in trust for the public good.
recently I've just been like taking a step back from my vlog and um, just feeling like it's such a strange thing to do. Sometimes I just, I, it's, I think it's so uncharacteristic of, of something that I would do. I don't know, it's just a, it's a strange thing, vlogging, you know? It's, uh, it, not everybody does it, not everybody would even like it, not everybody condones it, not everybody would watch it. There's sort of a, you know, I, I'm trying to describe what it is that I do when I'm vlogging, and I guess on a basic level it's entertaining. Oh, it's funny, uh, on my birthday yesterday, I heard from a lot of people, and thank you all so much for your wonderful well wishes for my birthday. Uh, friends, family, and followers, you know. And I just realized how many people it reaches, and how entertaining, even in a small, even in such a small way it is for those folks, and how special it is, so it kind of, you know, I go through this sine wave of, of doubt and confidence with the vlog, like, why am I doing this, and oh my gosh, this is the greatest thing, and why am I doing this, and oh my gosh, what's, you know, so it's a funny, it's a funny relationship I have with it. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I have to build a closet rod for Milo so he can hang up shirts. Imagine being 15 and your parents don't even have a place for you to hang your shirts except, like, on the back of your door. Poor kid. Hey. Sounds like you got a little exhaust leak there, mother. Just, they just got it back in the shop. <laughs> they, they put a new one on, probably a couple of three hundred dollars. Now it's already making a noise. Yeah, yeah. You find your second bag? No, I forgot to look. Yeah. Step here is I'm gonna I need a shelf top. I don't have the wood right now. And this place for hanging. Let's check it out. See if it works. Yeah. business phone. This is a cellular phone that you plug a regular phone into. Hello. This is a way for me to then forward my business number to my uh, cell phone. So this is my interim solution. There has been one recommendation from um, one of my subscribers for a different method using Google Phone that I'm definitely going to research because it sounds like a no-cost way to take an old phone number and attach it to your cell phone or your landline, which that would be wicked cool, thank you. You know, it's just when I start to, to doubt myself and vlogging as part of my life that um, I hear back from so many of you how enjoyable it is to watch. So, you know, I'm not going anywhere. I'm approaching my half year mark. I would love to set my goal as one year of vlogging. I think that would be great. Anyway, thanks for coming with me on my day. And oh, you know, if you haven't told me where you live, meaning your city and country, uh, let me know because 
I can put you on my subscriber map, what I call the Scriber map. And that way I can better know where main vlog is being viewed around the world. Thanks for coming with me all my day, and I'll see you tomorrow. I just wanna, I just wanna, I just wanna.